now that we've exported our chunks and our embeddings to a vector database, we have completed creating the data preparation for a RAG pipeline. We can optionally try out and query the database for the chunks that we just created. This isn't required, but we can try it out anyway. So let's go into retrieval and let's add a template for Elasticsearch since we stored our embeddings there. Let's go ahead and paste in the connection string that we used previously. And we will modify the template just a bit. And what we're mainly doing is using a hard coding a sample embedding. Great, let's go ahead and run this. And we can see this is what we sent. This is all just logging that we added ourselves. Let's take a look at the output. Great, let's go ahead and take a sneak peek at what was retrieved. So here we can see the chunks that were retrieved based off of the sample embedding that we used.